Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Megan May. For those of you who are new here, welcome. And if you're returning, hello again. We are getting really up close and personal right now because I'm going to walk you through all of the jewelry that I wore on my wedding day. How cute is this, first of all? I got this from my bachelorette. The gals gifted me this and put a bunch of goodies inside, but I used it on my wedding day to have all of my special jewelry in here because it is so meaningful to me. And I will always remember these brands and the jewelry that I wore because this is just a day that is just, it's ingrained. It's ingrained in my mind, the morning, the prep, getting ready with my mom, my mother-in-law, my sister-in-law, and my best friend, and it just, it was such a magical day, and the weather turned out perfect for the photos, and then right as we were done photos, it started raining, and then we went to the hotel, and we were like, yeah, like, we're cool to take photos inside the hotel, and then our videographer was like, there's literally no clouds outside, it's beautiful, the sun is shining, it's blue. So we were like, let's get our butts outside before the weather changes again. And honestly, like the photos and the video, I literally, I can't wait until I get to see everything because I'm just like, it's just, it was just so beautiful. If you guys want to know more wedding prep, I literally can make a whole video on this because I did everything from like starting in December, 2022, talking to our vendors, securing everything. And then... DIYing our save the dates, our invitations, our menu, our placeholders, um, all of the signage, everything. I just DIY'd because I was like, I'm not paying someone to do this when I myself am very creative and I could easily do this all on Canva and honestly like it turned out chef's kiss and I'm gonna give myself some credit where it's due because I freaking killed it. Like I could probably add wedding planner to my resume but I one wedding is enough <laughs> one and done we are one and done I know that you guys want to see everything that I wore on my wedding day and funny enough I'm still wearing the earrings that I wore on my wedding day so yeah okay, one of the options that I was gonna wear but it didn't get here in time it actually literally got here this past week and our wedding was like two weeks ago which is really sad because I would have been kind of twinning with my bridesmaids. Anyways, this piece of jewelry is from Miss Blue and it's so cute. The packaging is literally everything I would ever want. I really hope the camera caught that. That was the loudest thunderstorm of my life. This packaging is so beautiful. I love it so much. It is true to the name Miss Blue and it is is blue baby it comes in this cute packaging everything's blue i love i love branding branding just like really makes or breaks a product for me and they killed it miss blue is founded in new york and they are experts for lab grown diamonds moissanite natural gemstones and anything to do with like really fine jewelry engagement rings wedding bands they have a variety on their website and all of their options are so elegant and so beautiful so you can't go wrong with anything they have really beautiful and innovative designs and craftsmanship in all of their pieces so be sure to check out miss blue i will give you guys a discount link and I'll put everything in the description box below. These are the gorgeous, gorgeous earrings that they gifted me. These are lab-grown diamonds, and then they are pearls. I'm obsessed with them. I can't wait to wear these to my friend's wedding in September. You know your girl is gonna be decked out in diamonds and pearls because I, I love diamonds and pearls. The next thing that I got from Miss Blue is this gorgeous lab grown diamond wedding band it is so beautiful and then this is what it looks like stacked i'm gonna i'm gonna double it up but if i have my engagement ring with it it's just a little it's too much moving on to linher i've worked with them before graciously got to work with them again I ended up gifting my bridesmaids some earrings and they are literally 
the most perfect earrings that I could have ever have asked for. They were my vision, Lynn her executed, and the girls were just like over the moon happy with them. I'm gonna put a little video here of the earrings because obviously the girls have them, but they were perfect on wedding day. Be sure to use code Megan May for a special offer when shopping through the link in the description. And then they gifted me this pearl necklace. I love it so much and also will be wearing it on my friend's wedding day. I think it'll go gorgeous with the dress that I'm wearing and it'll just be a staple piece in my wardrobe and it's so elegant and so beautiful. And I love this little clasp. It's a silver clasp and it's just, again, absolutely stunning. I love all of Lynn Her's pieces. I think that they are so elegant and honestly, like they are worth the investment because you know that they're gonna last, you know the quality and they're just, they speak for themselves. So thank you Lynn Her, because I love the pieces, I do. And again, the girls were so happy. So if you need to get gifts for your bridesmaids, mother-in-law, for yourself, honestly, Linher is the place to check it out because everyone is always happy when they receive a piece from Linher. The earrings that I did end up wearing on my wedding day are from Ana Luisa. I did have a video of this previously and I'm pretty sure I showed you guys these earrings. They are so beautiful, so elegant, so simple, and that's what I love about them. So again, I will put everything in the description box below. I love all of my jewelry, all of my pieces. Again, they're so sentimental to me. So thank you, Miss Blue, Linher, and Ana Luisa for making my wedding dreams come true. I couldn't have looked as stunning without you guys. So thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you in the next one. Megan May out.